joined. Hey, mama. <laughs> Thank you so very much, everyone, for joining. The next woman I'm going to bring on right now, let me see that she's a bit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the next woman I'm bringing on is Abidemi Taiwo. Abidemi Taiwo is a phenomenal young woman. Oh, sh she's here. <laughs> Hi, Abby. <laughs> Welcome, Abby. Okay, I have to call you Abidemi for this. I call you Abby, but I'm going to call you Abidemi for this session <laughs> because we both no. are. <laughs> Welcome. Thank you so very much for joining us this evening. Thank you for having me. Thank you for organizing this, setting this up, and inviting us. Thank you. It is an honor to have women like you who are not just. I, and I keep saying this, I have seen in, in Mary Kay, I've, been, I've only been in Mary Kay for less than two months, but in, that, in the two months, I've seen women who are thriving in business, in their business, and businesses, because a lot of you run yeah. businesses. Oh, Director Abby! Oh, yeah, Director Abby! <laughs> <laughs> so, I, in, in Mary Kay, I've seen women who run several businesses, and these women yeah. are thriving. And not just that, these women are so passionate about helping other women succeed. Yeah. I mean, I think that is the biggest thing for me, Mary Kay. Absolutely. When I met you first, you fine. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I saw you on the she, And then I hear your name is Abby. I'm like, oh, she's my nurse. <laughs> This girl is crazy. <laughs> Thank you. Instagram, and I watch a lot of your interviews, and I'm like, whoa. Oh. Beyond the beauty, the pretty face, there is so much substance in you. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. And I, I feel so privileged that I can have a rapport with women like you. Oh. You know what? It's really such a blessing. I saw a lot of your interviews on YouTube as well, and I was really blown away. So I'm going to let you introduce yourself. Oh, <laughs> Abby, thank you so much. Thank you um, for your kind words. I really, really appreciate it. Um, I'm so, I feel so honored to be here. Um, oh, God. So I'm just going to do a little introduction, introduction about myself. As Abby, we call, you, we call her Sunshine Abby. Um, as she has rightly said, um, I'm also Abby, Abby Demi Taiwo. And I, my background really is in nursing. I studied mental health nursing, but right now I work as a recruitment consultant. That's my day job. That's my nine to five job. I, I'm also a presenter. I have a talk show called um, On the Couch with Abby. And of course, I'm a very capable consultant. <laughs> and how the business? I got into the Mary Kay business. My story is a little different because um, I've been in the Mary Kay world for the past over four years now, actually. Um, my journey started in 2016. As a teenager, I had, I had suffered from severe acne. And then, of course, I was still living in London at this time in 2015. And my older sister, she's still, she's still in London now. She just came home one day and she was like, oh, you need to meet. There's a woman I need you to meet. And I was like, okay. She literally acted as if this woman was going to solve the, <laughs> the problems in my life as a young adult. And the woman is Director Abby, Abby Joando, and she's on here. I can see her comments. Um, so I met her, and then I went for a facial. So she facialed me. I went into her office in Hollandale. And um, yeah, that's how my Mary Kay journey really started. But I did actually start using the product until January 2016. And to be honest, since then, I've not looked back. Like, no one can sell any other cosmetic brand to me right now. No way. <laughs> but in terms of the business, um, I've been in and out, in and out. But this lockdown, I would say, I mean, that this lockdown has been a special one in a way that it really opened my eyes to the possibilities that Mary Kay really has to offer. Yeah. So, yeah. Thank you. So if I understand you clearly, you didn't come to Mary Kay at first because you wanted to make because you heard of the profit and how great you can the, the business in itself is. Yeah. Yeah. I came to do I came into the business for the product. Sorry, I came to Mary Kay for the product. 
Okay, food products. Yeah, great. So, and since you've joined Mary Kay, now, not just as a product user, a product lover, but as a consultant, how has the journey been so far? And what has been, what would you say is your greatest achievement so far? Wow. Um, and it's been an amazing journey. But at the same time, of course, I've had my challenges. Um, but the one thing that I would say is the mentorship that you get. I mean, I'm always in constant um I'm always in touch with Abby Jiwando. She's my director and she recruited me. And the mentorship that you get really is invaluable. You know, money cannot buy it. So I would say that's one of the great things that I love about being, being in the business. Another thing is just being around women. I mean, we would normally have a, a, an event every Saturday and it is called Ordinary Women Doing Extraordinary Things. And to be amongst those amazing women, it's just, I think it's just phenomenal. So what would I say has been my biggest achievement? I mean, last month was a very good month for me. I achieved the 1000 Club. I had three people <laughs> signed up. Um, but I think we very care as well. One thing, Abby, is that it's not so. It's not just about the money that you make. It's not just about the people that you recruit. Or it's not just only about going up the ladder. The the, the self development that you gain from it, <laughs> it's just it's second to none. You know, you're always building yourself. You're not the same woman that you were last month. This is not July. You have a new goal. You have a new target that you want to meet before the end of the month, especially being, you know, it being the end of the seminar year. Yeah. I hope that your question. Yeah, it did. It, it, it did answer my question perfectly. And I hear this. I, I, I feel this is one thing that resonates with every woman in America. Tola is also saying here that money can't buy the mentorship. And <laughs> And now, and she just said the self development is the highlight for me, for her, you know. So, this all these women are saying the same thing. So, it can't be a lie. Do you get what no. I mean? <laughs> How this is always the highlight for every woman, you know. And thank you so very much. Thank you so very much for shedding this for other people as well. So, how long do you see yourself doing this? Oh, wow. Um, I don't know, till forever. <laughs> I'm definitely not stopping now. I am going to keep pushing myself. Um, and that's the goal, really, to just keep pushing myself, pushing myself. You know, one thing, uh, another great thing, Abby, with Mary Kay, is that there are some things that you think you can't do, but once you do them, like, you would think, oh, my God, I can't talk to people. You know, I can't make this call. I don't want to feel, I don't want to disturb people. But then just just go for it. I mean, that's what I keep doing. And um, I'm definitely seeing the results. And I just, I mean, the, the goal really is to, to go higher. So there's, there's no stopping now. There's no stopping now. Yeah, it's great that you say that. And then you know that the moment you hit that point where you thought you couldn't do, you know that drive that pushes you like, if I did this, then I can do much more. Uh-huh, exactly. I was like, oh, I did that. So that means, oh, I can get to that next level. And then you get to that next level and it's like, so why, why would you want to stop? No way. <laughs> I think you should read Director Abe's, Abe's um, comment, our last comment. <laughs> yes, Director, that's what we are aiming for, really, um, to be a director. Honestly, I like Big Abby, Director Abby keeps saying, Abby, every time I talk to her, she's like, you're going to DIQ, you're going to DIQ. So... <laughs> Um, oh my gosh! <laughs> see yourself like is there someone in American right now that you are seeing yourself and you're like this is where I want to go to is there anyone in American right now that you see and you're like I want to get here oh wow that's an amazing question <laughs> to be honest with you Abby all the women inspire me starting from the NSD to NSD Elizabeth Ozua to Abby Jawando to Banker Marino to Beatrice Hodgson like to Director Marcelina like they're all inspiring and I think everyone and that's one thing I'm learning everyone is we're all on a different we're all on a, a unique journey so I wouldn't say I want to be like anyone but they really do inspire me and I hope to be able to get to that sort of level that they are but I want to be me i have someone i want to be like <laughs> gloria banks that woman girl <laughs> that woman is phenomenal 
She's full of oh, she owes it so much confidence. <laughs> if you have someone like that that we all look up to, it is very difficult for you not to be that kind of person in 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 a few months, a few years. I mean, absolutely. Even our directors, our, di our immediate directors, they are like they're so phenomenal in their own ways that I, I know. Like director Abby, I look at her. And she's a mentor, even outside of Mary Kay. Um, and these are women that, you know, they have the experience, they have the knowledge, they have the wisdom. And there's so much more than, than you know, I don't know, than what meets the eye. These are women of substance. These are women that are also on fire for God. Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. That is so, so true. And really, for someone like me who I, I, know, where, I know where my priorities are, Mm -hmm. I know that things that are important to me. As much as I want to be a businesswoman, I want to thrive in business, I know that that is not like the ultimate for me. Mm -hmm. I know that it's very, very important. And then to see a company that puts God first, your family second, and then your career third. Amazing. That is amazing. So thank you so very much. I do not want to keep you. For... Oh, I've kept you for quite a while. <laughs> oh, how many, how many have we been talking? <laughs> 12 minutes. <laughs> 12 minutes. We only had 10 minutes. Thank you so much, Abby. God bless you. Uh, honestly, thank you for, for organizing this. I really, really appreciate it. Thanks for the invite. So very much. Love you, girl. See you later. Bye. Bye.